Relaxation and gratitude. Have you ever wondered where all the lines on your face are coming from? You know, we wake up in the morning, we wash our face, we brush our teeth, and the same thing when we go to bed at night. We wash our face, we brush our teeth, we are looking at ourselves in the mirror, and if you're not taking a close look, are you wondering where those little lines keep showing up at? I mean, they come around your eyes, they come down here in this part, they come around your mouth, they come all along your decollage. They're just everywhere, and they just show up overnight. I know. Can you believe that? Do you know where they're coming from? That's the biggest question. And do you think it's all about age? You think everything that we have happening is all about we're getting older, and so all this stuff starts happening. We start falling apart. You know, whatever the excuses we give ourselves to say, it is all about age right i don't believe that at all and are you wondering about the excess weight you get in the middle i mean your belly your thighs you know your whole torso area are you wondering why that's coming from and why it just shows up so it's it's hormones it's actions it's less of action it's a lot of different things that are holding you back and keeping you out there where you're not getting where you need to go because you're getting too irritated with what you're looking like and you don't want to exercise because exercising is not fun for a lot of people and it's also can be a headache so when you have the weight around the middle and you're starting to get headaches and you're getting all these different symptoms that keep showing up and then you throw in the why can't i reach my goals I'm working really hard. Why can't I reach them? Why aren't they coming to me like they're supposed to? So all of this is, you're going to hear it, is lack of, lack of gratitude for what you have right now. And also it is you getting out there and being. And you know, you're, you're saying, well, Christy, I say my affirmations and all that stuff every day. And the stress still comes, and I still get irritated, and I'm still not getting everything done, and I can't sleep at night, and I'm having problems with that. I toss and turn and toss and turn. I can't get to sleep, so I'm up half the night. Then the alarm goes off, and I have to get up because it's time to get up. Sound familiar? So take a look at how many times a day you are stressed and irritated. I mean, it doesn't matter if you are stressed and irritated at your job. It's not going to matter if you're stressed and irritated at your home. What is happening? I mean this. This is a question. What is happening for you or to you or with you that you have all of this stress and all this irritation coming your way? Could it be that maybe, maybe, I'm just saying maybe, you have these affirmations that you maybe you created your own and you're saying them every day and you're saying them with diligence you you're they're in your routine you say them every day excuse my throat guys i lost my voice yesterday and i'm hoping it holds up this morning so does this all sound familiar to you you know if it does then you are on a track, then you are on a path. So what is happening is we don't realize this simple little step. It is so simple. And you know, with, with me, everything, I take something hard and I'll create it and break it down and make it as simple as possible because that's how my brain works, to make everything as simple as possible. If it's a hard system, I'll make it as simple and easy to use as I can. So when you're connected with yourself, with your feelings, and you relax yourself into a gratitude state, how does that make you feel? When you can relax yourself into a gratitude state, or maybe you could turn it around if it works better for you to start with gratitude on something you're grateful for it has to be totally from the heart grateful 
it has to be from in here it can't be just a word you say out of repetition your gratitude has to come from the heart and what i've learned over the years and i'm going to date myself back here to the days of the dinosaurs almost i know crazy right if you're still noticing you get these crazy little lines that creep up and you got them around you get deep lines here you get deep lines on your forehead or you know if you're there in there or anywhere like that and you're not sure where those little buggers are coming from then you know what I'm gonna tell you this um, I missed my hair up of course five minute hairdo with the sore throat day yeah so all right back to tactics what happens is you can't sleep at night. You can't get focused. You can't keep anything going. You're working so hard and you're doing every system, every strategy, everything out there to make your business work. Maybe you're only working it part time because you work a full time job. You got kids, you got the house, you got everything going on in your world. That's stress. That is a lot of stress that you are putting on yourself. So, what do you do this is a question what do you do to relax yourself yeah i mean relax yourself what i found out and listen to this really close because what i have found out is if i can't sleep at night for some reason whatever it is i've got too many things going on in my brain that night or whatever if I can't get myself to go right down to sleep, if I do some deep breathing and relax, I don't tell my brain, think of this or sleep or do any of that fun stuff. I just tell myself, relax, relax. And the more I put out, relax, and I make my body relax, I make my mind relax then it's easier to fall into a state of sleep and sleep soundly throughout the night and if i happen to wake up in the night in the middle of the night for some reason then i'll do the same thing again i just tell myself relax relax and then i just throw in a little gratitude that i'm so happy i have my comfortable bed to sleep on i'm so happy i've got these warm comforters I'm so happy, you know, whatever it is I'm grateful for. When you throw happy on your emotion, on your emotions, on your self, when you throw happy and gratitude into the mix, it's much easier for you to relax your mind, relax your body. If you can relax your body first, I mean, start at the toes, work your way up, start at the head, work your way down, whatever, whatever system works for you. It also relieves stress and tension. When you can relax yourself and get into a state of gratitude, a state of gratitude will help you to relax and be in a happy state. A happy state will also help relieve stress and tension and the tension and the stress are what causes those little lines and the deep lines and the lines here and the lines there so if you're getting them all over the place take a look at what you're doing use relieving stress and tension and I know you're working hard but don't let that get in the way of how you're feeling and how you're looking when you can feel good and you can look in the mirror and be happy with who you are it doesn't matter you've got the roll coming around the middle you're gaining weight or whatever it is some of its hormones and some of it is lack of exercise but do you know this is a proven scientific fact here i'm going to share with you do you know that actually exercising it doesn't have to be you know super hard or you know super bad or anything like that but exercising relieves stress it can relieve diabetes it can relieve irritation it can relieve the emotions that hold you down just by exercising a little bit so I know I do 
I do a little bit of yoga, you know, stretching and just when I'm feeling. If I'm working on a system, I'm working on a, a course or something that I'm building, I'm creating. If I start to get a little irritated or a little stressed at what I'm doing, I'll take a few minutes and I'll just remove myself from the situation. Go to another room, walk around. Walk around is good. I walk around and I just relax my mind, relax my body, you know, do some shakeouts and do some, you know, deep knee bends, do some relaxing, do some stretching. That refocuses me into a state of relaxed mind. When I have a relaxed mind, the solution to what I'm working on comes easier. It comes simpler and it comes easier when I have a relaxed mind. And I know I've told you this several times before, probably a thousand times, but gratitude is the number one vibration in the world, all of the universe. It's the number one vibration that will bring results to us. It may not be exactly when you want it. It may be a little bit because you got to get into the tune of it. But you know what? Get in there and make your life the way you want it. Sorry, guys. My throat is really starting to close up here. So, And, yes, I did meditate on my throat, and that's why I can talk now. Um, hold on just a second. But anytime you are getting into the stress mode or you're getting irritated with something, something's not working for you, something is just, you know, flying by the seat of your britches and you're like oh my gosh why can't i get this why is this not working it's easier to get focused if you can relax and i do this throughout the day if i like i said if i get stressed or if i get irritated irritation is the worst if i get irritated because i can't figure it out or i can't come up with the solution that i need for what i'm working on or how to put it together or how to write this system or how to put this course into play or what am I going to tell my team you know what I've got to help my team so that they can get the success they need what am I going to do when I do that and I get myself worked up and we do it to ourselves guys we do it to ourselves we make ourselves chunky we make ourselves get wrinkles and lines and all this stuff we don't want we make ourselves unhealthy we do it to ourselves and this is a actually a known scientific fact it's a quantum it's a quantum physics fact and it's science and it's medical and it's there and you don't have to go pop a lot of pills to make it work for you it does not take you going to get medicine it does not take you getting something because you can't quit eating or it doesn't take you doing that it takes you taking control of yourself and relaxing relax your body relax your mind relax every muscle when you do this when you can just take five minutes five minutes guys just five little minutes and relax yourself you're going to find you will have better skin You'll have a trimmer body. You'll have a little bit of muscle, you know, you who guns. You will have the life you want. And not just that, you know how much easier it is for the universe to give you your lifestyle and to help put everything into play for you. Do you know how much easier it is when you are relaxed and in a gratitude, happy mindset? You have to be happy. And when the more happy you are, smile. A smiling face with lines is much more attractive than a frowny face with wrinkles. Right? I mean, come on. We all know it's true. We know that it's easier to receive and to attract the right people to us when we are happy. It's a fact of life. So, take a look at what you're doing and how you're doing it because when you can relax with gratitude you can have your home business you can have the job promotion 
You can have your family being happy also. You can have everything come to you in a way that is beneficial, beneficial to everyone in your life, in your world. And if you're a leader and you're out here, you're on my plane or whatever you're at, and you're growing your business and you, you're helping your team to grow and to be successful, then take those steps in a relaxed mode. Don't make other people around you stressful or tension. Help everyone else to be relaxed with gratitude. And you'll be surprised the people that are on your team that you're helping, that you're showing the systems to, you're showing the strategies to, they're going to be able to take those strategies and run with them and make the money they want. I find this is true for the people on my team. I'm able to help them to be successful, use their mindset, use the business, use the marketing, and put it all together. Because successful people with money are happy people with money. That's just one way to phrase it. I say that because I do coaching, I do a lot of training and whatnot, but I also do just a lot of group chats. And that came up on a, a chat earlier this morning. And another leader, he, he said, you know, happy people with money produce happy people with money. And it took me a few minutes to get the grasp on that, but then it makes sense because then you're not as stressed. You're not feeling the stress. So the thing is, relax before, because if you relax before you're getting the money, before it's flowing to you, you'll find it's easier for the universe to bring those systems, those strategies, those people to you that are going to give you the systems, the strategies, and the coaching that you need to grow your business and to be successful. So take this tip today, relaxation with gratitude is it actually makes you feel really really good so take a look at this again if you need the rewind if you need to do the um replay i believe that word is and sorry guys i'm just gonna have to end this it's not gonna happen anymore today so do this and please subscribe to our channel here on youtube it's at the bottom down there and also, there's going to be a link down there that's going to give you some more insight to grow your business. And it's going to give you another attraction step that is going to grow your business out of this water. It's crazy. Definitely use it. I suggest you get on there and get it going today. Do not delay. Also, there is a link to my um, newsletter. So you definitely want to get in on that. Okay, guys. Thank you all so much, and I will um, try to chat with you later, okay? Have a super great, relaxing, grateful day. Thank you.